Hey guys, welcome back to Minute Ministry, and we are still having technical difficulties with our editing software and computer. So, that being said, we are doing this in one shot, one go. All right, so there'll be mistakes. Please give me grace. Um, I've been thinking about how a lot of times we take certain commandments and certain things that God has tell, told us to do, and we put emphasis on certain things, and then we don't on others. So that being said, got a minute? Play that. Do, 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 do. All right. So that being said, um, when you look at it, we are told not to steal many times in the Bible, quite a few, maybe a handful of times. Um, we are told not to kill one another, a handful of times in the Bible. It's pretty important. Um, but we are told in the New Testament alone to love one another 56 times. This comes straight from Jesus' mouth. This comes from uh, pretty much every apostle. And they all say the same thing, love one another. And yet, we don't see that if somebody's not very loving, we don't see that as sinful. We see that as, well, they're just not really the lovey-dovey kind of type. Oh, they don't make connections with other people. Maybe uh, they were hurt before, so they don't. They kind of get this pass whenever it comes to the things that God has called us to do, and that's not right. Whenever it comes down to it, God has called us to love one another, and that's not just for other people's benefit, but that's for our benefit too. Because if we close ourselves off to the people that are around us, then we are no benefit to them, they're no, no benefit to us, and we can't fulfill our purpose. So God is calling us, God has commanded us, saying, hey, look, love one another, right? Love one another as I have loved you. And God didn't, as far as I remember, God didn't get hurt. I mean, he got hurt, but he didn't get hurt and then turn his back on people. Every time that we see him get hurt or get rejected, he got back up, he picked up his cross, and he continued to carry it. And so he was carrying it for us, no matter what our reaction was. And so as our model, that's what we need to do. So are you loving other people? Or are you living in some sort of sin? Do you see it as sin? And most importantly, you know, if you're loving other people, are you loving all of them? Are you loving everyone that God brings your way? So hopefully that's a good thought. I mean, I'm just waiting on my computer to get rebooted to the point where it will work again. But hopefully you'll get some edited videos within the week, if not early next week. Thanks for spending a minute.